This is the guitar lesson for the song Elevator by Box Car Racer. Um, this is a really simple song. Um, it's great. It's just one sequence the whole way throughout for two and a half minutes. Um, the only thing that's a little bit tricky about it is the timing. The chords change on an off note um, or an off beat um, a lot throughout the song. But it's a really simple riff. With, um, it's just three chords the whole way out. Um, so the song begins with a drum intro and um, then we come in with this. And that plays for the entire song. So what all that is is um, this. Um, that's just a G power chord. So you want to put your index finger on the 3rd fret of the E, put your ring finger on the 5th um, fret of the A, and your pinky on the 5th fret of the D. And I believe it's a full power chord, you add that pinky, it's not just a... because it just seems to have that sound to it in the recording. So you play that um, 16 times. Um, but then it's sort of like, it's, it's kind of an offbeat, I don't know, I'm not really good at explaining it, but you should start out by playing it 16 times and then just sliding and, and working between chords that way. And then once you've got the riff, then you can practice coming in on the offbeat. So if you're just learning this riff for the first time, I would just be like... Once you get a little bit more experienced, you could be like... So anyways, you play that 16 times, and then you slide up to a, um, a C power chord, play it on the, on the E string, so that's the 8th fret of the E. The uh, 10th fret of the um, A and D. And you play that 8 times slide down half a step to um, the B which is the seventh of the E and the ninth of the A and D and you play that eight times so you get and you can add in the open in between chords um, that's really good for transitions if you don't want like that to that to come through on the sound, you can just add in an open string. Or if you feel confident enough after you've practiced for long enough, you can just play it come in on the on the offbeat. But um look it's really up to you. Um this is a it's a good song to learn. Um it's probably one of the first songs I'd I'd recommend someone learning because it's so simple and um yeah, you can have a lot of fun with it. Um, so yeah, if you're if you're a complete beginner, you can learn this song, have a lot of fun with it, get some people around, impress them, and um, yeah, just keep playing, keep practicing, and I really hope this tutorial was helpful.